Hey folks, how are you doing in the land of grills? Take a look at all the smoke. Yeah, on the Ninja wood fire, I tell you what, we're using something that not even Ninja knows about, but these are, these are pellets that's in the hopper over there that are made of pecan shells. That's right, smoking pecan. It's from a family, a family company down in Louisiana that does, uh, they, they, ha they have pecan groves and they were looking at something to do with the shells. And so they started making all natural. This is very <laughs> ecological. You're talking about recycling. We're taking the shells, compressing them and making pellets out of them that's burning in your wood fire. And I'll tell you what, the smell from it, it is sweet. It is it's definitely not wood. And I've, I've, I've used this before on a pellet grill and it was phenomenal. So today we're gonna try it on the Ninja wood fire. And I've just got some short ribs. That's all, some beef short ribs. And I'll take a look, cause I'm, I've got them soaking them some beer. And then we're gonna put them on here, get some smoke on and get a little heat on them. Get a little sear on them and give you a look, see the final part. I'll tell you what, that's gonna be awesome. All right, we got our beef short ribs. I got any much of these, uh, six bucks right here. But uh, we've been soaking for about 45 minutes now and I've got some of this, uh, really like this spotted cow. I'm a Wisconsin resident, so I can get this here. It's very, very good beer. You can find it. And when you're, I like to do it with something I'd like to drink. Uh, nothing cheap, but, and then the seasoning, fire, water, all-purpose black garlic seasoning, great stuff. Let's get some smoke on it. All right, folks, let's take a look here. We've still got smoke rolling using <laughs> pecan shells. Can you believe that? On the Ninja wood fire, and we're just going to give them a turn here. Look at that. Nice sear lines. Very, very nice. This is like, oh, come on, yeah. It's like two minutes. So we're gonna get, we ain't gonna go much longer. Give them probably another two minutes on that side. Pull them off, give you a look-see. So you see smoke is still rolling. Now you gotta remember, in the preheat, it gets it going. So it, take, it takes a good four or five minutes before it says add food on high. And I just wanna give you a look-see at the pellets. Look at that, it's pretty cool. They are uh, still smoking and working just fine in the wood fire. On the Ninja wood fire, let's, uh, oh, look at that juice right there. That's probably medium. Let's, uh, you gotta do a taste test. Let's see how it is. So I knew what I bought. I've done these before. I've never been successful at them. So I decided to soak them in beer for they were almost an hour. And then get some smoke on it. Now the smoke from the wood fire did get in there. That pecan smoke. It, I'll tell you what, folks, you gotta try that. Whatever you got. You got Pelgo, you got the wood fire, got a, I'll leave the link down below. It's kind of meat. It's just it's not good. It's tough. It really is. You should probably try this in jelly, because chili would probably, or after, it would probably soften it up. But on the grill, no way. Not that good. But a lot of smoke in there from the wood fire, and that pecan, oh man. You guys gotta try that out, regardless of what you got. Tom Horseman, YouTube, thumbs up, leave a comment. As always, thanks for watching.